I just find Dutch Schultz treasure in the gunks, not in the Catskills. Is it in the safe? There's a lot of cool stuff to be found in the woods and you never know what you're gonna run into, but uh, this is one of the weirder ones in the John Burroughs Park. There's a giant safe. When I say giant safe, it's a good one too, because you'll notice the hinges are not exposed. I put my size 14 clod hopper on there so you can get an idea how big that is. That's a size 14 boot with a hole in it. No idea what's in it. Probably Dutch Schultz treasure. Welcome to the worst marked trailhead in New York. I drove right up in someone's private property, stayed on the road, but uh, there's no markings that uh, this is the trailhead. So the sign of the North American ass hat. If you're that person, you need to get punched in the face. I didn't research this uh, hike. I just needed something easy because I'm getting over an illness and uh, I just realized that 0.14 miles. I've arrived at my location. Kind of funny. Did John Burroughs use this handle? We'll never know. Was this his master lock? We'll probably pretty sure we know. All right, we're gonna head towards the celery swamp. Little known fact about the celery swamp, that's where they literally made the first ants on a log in North America. So if you've ever had ants on a log, you're a peanut butter fan, you're a fan of John Burroughs, name right there. No idea why. Interesting. Trail guys. We can use a trail guy. Let's see. Survey settings. Mmm, trail guys.
GoPros are horrible at distance, but uh, there must have been a private residence up top. And there's all kinds of heavy duty metal stuff thrown down the embankment from yesteryear. There's a giant furnace somewhere over there and a whole bunch of metal debris up there. It's kind of interesting how some of it filtered down to the bottom. I guess that was the uh, garbage disposal. It's beautiful rock bands through the whole. If you like rock formations, this is the place. There's a lot of fun ledges, and bands, cliffs, a lot of good stuff to see. This never ending uh, fantastical rock sculptures. Very nice. Interesting. Interessante. I don't know if that's a root cellar or a well. I also see an old safe in the woods. Some sort of giant drunkard riding on a barrel. I don't know. Might not be a drunkard. Yeah, this is interesting. There's definitely something down there. I'm not walking across it to find out. I see the safe on some sort of wall. Ah, interesting. Is it in this safe? Probably not, because uh, essentially it looks like <laughs> looks like somebody already got in there. Another fun trail. Lots of stonework. Very nice. It's gonna be great in the spring when the water's really flowing. Beginning of the video, I said uh, slab sides was really close to the parking area. Where I popped out on that loop and just went through those fun uh, remains is just down the South Pond Trail. I didn't know the lay of the land, but if you have kids and you just want to get down to the pond house, you could do slab sides over there. Or you could hang a right at the privy, hit those little waterfalls, you'll be at the pond in less than five minutes.